It's a pleasure to greet you. I'm going to talk to you about M-Learning plus action research and decision making for problem-based learning as a strategy to prepare students for business practices. I apologize to you because English is not my third language, so I might make some mistakes, but I'll try to do my best. This research work is being carried out with the University of Salamanca PhD program on education in the Knowledge Sociality Scope. So, I thank the doctoral school for their accompaniment and support me in this presentation. The authors of the dissertation are Sandra Torres Taborda, Sonia Casillas Martin, and Marcos Cabezas Gonzalez. I'm from Colombia. My country has been working hard in recent years to reduce the digital divide and although we have enormous challenges in terms of connectivity and internet access. But the use of mobile devices has grown in a representative way. In 2020, the total number of mobile lines was 65,478,000 177 equivalent to a penetration rate of 130%. This is evidence of the rapid development of information and communication technologies and the way they are part of our daily lives. This implies new challenges and opportunities to design of educational materials. Based on this, mobile learning is presented as an alternative to favor the symbiotic relationship between university and companies, so that by incorporating mobile digital elements to easy access for students in teaching strategies, collaborative learning and knowledge generation are motivated. Project-based learning is a didactic option of great value because through interinstitutional agreements with the productive sector is feasible to allow students to have an approach with the business reality and organizations to benefit from the contributions of academia in favor of the generation of value for their customers. In this context, the need arises to design a virtual laboratory for business practices which will be implemented at the Corporación Universitaria de Sabaneta, an institution with 12 years of existence and located in the smallest municipality in the country, but which has approximately 870 companies. One hypothesis is that project-based learning implemented through M-Learning and Action Research and Decision-Making Model will have a positive impact on the business practice process because by using a mobile application as a virtual practice laboratory, students will face real problems, work under the concept of consulting and develop communication skills. Currently, the project is in the design and application phase. For this reason, we cannot establish, establish results. Although, to obtain the results, both qualitative and quantitative analysis will be carried out that will allow evaluating, evaluating the depend variables of the student, the acquisition of professional skills and competences of students in business practice stations.